Channel 5. ...on a shelf for 40 years. We took a poll on the campus and almost everybody voted for Artie Shaw's band. Artie Shaw? Who's Artie Shaw? Yeah. Artie Shaw rivaled Benny Goodman and Glenn Miller as one of the most popular leaders of the big band era. During the 30s and 40s, he had huge hits like Begin the Begin, for Nessie, Stardust, and many more. Shaw left the music business in 1954 because record companies weren't interested in the new jazz directions he was pioneering. Forty years later, he has released a new CD, Artie Shaw, More Last Recordings, The Final Session. Evidence Shaw was a step ahead of his time. The clarinet I'm playing on that is I was this close to the mic. You could hear the keys click. Well, that was deliberate because when you played that quietly on the edge, you know, to play a clarinet, you have to make a reed vibrate. People don't think about this, and that's supposed to. But if you're blowing a note, the reed has to vibrate. If you don't blow it loud enough for the reed to vibrate, the note stops. Well, I was at the very edge of that. Trying to control that is very hard to do. But if you can do it, you get a particular quality that I don't think anybody ever got. Shaw's new CD competes in a marketplace with bands like Smashing Pumpkins and Nine Inch Nails, a different musical landscape than that of Shaw's day. I asked a kid one time, what do you get out of these rock concerts? What do you pay a hundred bucks for to go to hear a program by Adam Ant? And one kid says, you're asking the wrong questions, you're getting the wrong answers. The smart kid, he, he opened my eyes and my ears. He said, we don't go there to listen, we go there because it's a party. At this site once stood the Palomar Ballroom. Now it's a grocery store. In 1935, Benny Goodman and his band first garnered national attention for swing music. From that moment on, big bands dominated popular music until the early 50s. Coincidentally, that was when Shaw, at the height of his abilities, quit playing forever. If you do something beyond an audience's comprehension, you're wasting a lot of talent on those people. And we're talking about an audience of, for popular music. This was music not designed to be, quote, popular. Even though it's been years since Shaw played the clarinet, he still goes through the motions in his sleep. I wake up in the middle of the night with that, telling myself, you don't have to do it anymore, forget it. I found a new finger in the Mozart clarinet to concerto. I haven't played that thing in 40 years. Artie Shaw made a tremendous impact on the music of the big band era. Though he hasn't played in four decades, his music, through his new CDs, has a chance to shake up the music world of the 90s. From Los Angeles, I'm David Adelson for E! News Daily. Still to come on E! News Daily, a violent video game gets a facelift.